Good morning students I am Pawan your science master students in this video I'm going to talk to 7th standard students students can you observe the image displayed on the screen yes what can you observe you can observe two students are sitting and studying in their study room yes they are very good students because they are studying right i want you also to be a good student like these students how they are studying you to study like that students let us observe where are they sitting they are sitting under light yes or no yes they are sitting under light see here the name of the boy is rajesh and the name of the girl is pavani they are sitting in their study room and you observed here they are sitting under a light and i will show you another image on the screen students you have to observe the difference from this image to that image yes students can you observe this image what difference do you notice you notice that there the power is gone the students are looking at where they are looking at the light but you know students what do we need to glow the light can you expect what lesson are we going to learn in this video students we are learning about electricity current and its effect can you repeat after me electricity current and its effect i will show you the sub concepts of this chapter yeah this is the chapter that we are going to study in this video students current and its effect this is the first lecture students at the end of the chapter you will be able to learn about see the sub concepts here in black color make your own cell dry cell symbols of electric components how to draw circuit diagrams series and parallel circuits heating effect of electric current tube light and compact fluorescent lamps electric fuses miniature circuit breaker in short form we call it as mcb and finally electricity in our home building students these are the sub concepts that we are able to understand at the end of this chapter okay now let's get into the content students this is the name of the chapter electricity current and its effect students in this video let me read some text and explain rajesh and pavani are studying at night and the power goes off rajesh searches the table desk for the torch and the batteries yes did you understand here rajesh and pavani were studying at night in their study room but suddenly what happened power goes off then what does rajesh search for rajesh searches for the torch and batteries in his table desk then pavani tries to insert the batteries in the torch she tries for a few minutes and the torch lights up yes they tried to get light from a torch light yes you must be familiar with such a situation yes or no yes in your houses while you are studying you may also have the same experience okay students 
yeah here there are some questions given for you you please try to answer these questions students do you know how to insert batteries in a torch can you make out whether the switch of the torch is working properly can you determine whether the bulb in the torch is fused yes first of all you should know how to insert the battery cells into the torch then you have to check out the switch of the torch is working properly or not whether the switch of the torch is working properly or not and then what you have to check out you have to determine whether the bulb in the torch is fused or not okay fused in the sense if the bulb filament is broken then that bulb is called fused bulb right and you will study in detail about that and before learning all of these before understanding answers for these questions you need to make your own battery cell you need to make what own battery cell you need to make your own battery cell students how you have to make your own battery cell students to make your own battery cell there you need to gather these operators which are displayed on the screen yes can you notice what are the operators displayed on the screen two injection bottles copper wires led bulb and zinc strip scissors okay and rubber corks you know rubber stoppers the mouth of the injection bottles you know rubber stoppers yes we have to assemble these operators together and we have to make a bulb glow students how to assemble assemble means how to connect all of these operators let us understand okay so this you have to do as a lab activity lab experiment what is the aim of the lab experiment here to make your own cell and what is the first side heading of this lab activity what is the side heading first side heading of lab activity make your own cell very good and what are the operators required operators are like can you name the operators displayed on the screen two injection bottles two injection bottles copper wires copper wires led bulb led bulb and rubber stoppers of the injection bottles you can see yes rubber stoppers and something is there in the injection bottles what might be that a liquid what is the name of the liquid do you know charan no don't know let us understand what is the liquid taken here student you have to write the name of the operators and then you have to start procedure how to do this activity in the next video i will teach you about how to make your own battery cell own cell how to make your own battery cell okay students and this is for this video students be prepared for the next class and uh, uh, you keep watching this video as many times as you can you have to mention the learning points in your notebook students thank you for listening and thank you one and all